Hey everybody, welcome back to Games Played Terribly. Playing some Earthbound. Back in the desert again. Um, There's a pyramid. Oh, found the pyramid. Oh shit. There's a hint, man. Yeah, but I don't want a hint. And that, that, Why not? Because I don't I don't know. Because I don't think I need a hint. Who's this guy? I sell water to those who are thirsty. It's expensive, though. Yeah, I'm not going to pay $200 for a bottle of water. Well, I mean, Dude, we found the pyramid. That's Look at this. Markup. Are you a thief, a warrior, or one who has come to see my majesty? You must decide what you really are. Therefore, what will you do? Do you remember what the, uh... I don't know. I don't. Oh, okay, I do. It's in the shape of a star. Oop. Hopefully this worked. Maybe? Did I not do it right? Oh! There you go. Warriors, enter now! Search for the Hawkeye! Ooh, Hawkeye Pierce! From M.A.S.H. Oh god, are you serious? Again? Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. It's... I like that he's perched, dude. He seems to be always perched nowadays. The, uh... <clears throat> Watch out for the UFO. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get in there before he gets over here. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, shit. God damn it. Well, got the sneak. Always be prepared. I thought I was. <clears throat> I went right into him. No. <clears throat> and we're dead. Off so far off to a wonderful start. The uh I, li I like the amount of explana er, ex explanations, exclamations that follow their names. Erected. A. Is that webbing coming out of their butt, or is that just like a tail, or is that? It kind of looks like a like a bomb fuse, like they're a bomb spider. But I think it might be web webbing. It's I don't know. Can spiders have tails? Well, I mean, and then it's down. No, they can't. It's probably webbing, but it's also what's that underneath? It's just a weird. Yeah, it is kind of a weird model. And yeah. Why does it have a long burger basket as the background? I don't know. It's just very strange to me. The uh, we're reaching a weird part of this game. Dude, yeah, Krakens you're don't me. look like Krakens. Yeah, that Kraken was interesting looking. Well, it doesn't look like a Kraken. It's like they took the word Kraken. And they didn't really. They just knew that it was a sea creature. Yeah, they just made it's a like sea when, monster uh, out of it. It's like when you got a heat stroke. Fuck. It just seems like. Uh, oh no, maybe poisoned. It's yeah, like it's uh, when uh, when people like uh, I don't know if it was the Greeks. I can't remember what culture. Oh, maybe it was the it was uh, the Asian Asian culture uh, and their history. I like how the hieroglyphs. Oh, it's moving. Ooh. Um, how they would draw lions. I think it's the Chinese actually. They would draw lions and they would have lions because they've heard about it, but they'd never actually seen it. So it was their own interpretation of what a lion would be. Sure. Kind of the same thing here. Fuck, that was rad. That's a weird. Uh, did it, the. What happened there? I smashed him. I smashed him with something. Oh, there you go. Wazuki's 52! Oh, baby! Offense went up by three. That's pretty rad. I need to heal... Or, uh, life up cheese, I think. What's his max? Uh, I think if you just do A, it's More fine. More that, yeah, probably. Life up A. Yeah, it is interesting to think about, too. Like, you think... You look at, uh... Uh, dragons. And how all of these different... Ooh, got a viper. All these different cultures came up with their own interpretations of what dragons were, you know, before they ever shared that information together. So you have all these uh, different interpretations of dragons swimming around, and they're all, like, kind of slightly different. But I think it's interesting, especially because dragons are mythical, you know, beings. Something out there made people, th like, think of that imagery, I guess. Unicorns the same way? Yeah. Unicorns are different in different places. <laughs> The, uh... <clears throat> yeah, there's something mythically appealing about a horned horse, I guess. Well, and just the different, different, uh... Different things with, uh... The way that they looked and... Yeah. Actually, if you read Hard Boiled Wonderland and the, uh... End of the World, Hiroki Murakami involves unicorns in some ways. Nice. And the interpretation of unicorns are... Is very interesting. Um... Is it yeah. more of a of a fictional interpretation or like a... uh well the man has a unicorn skull or what he believes I guess that's kind of spoilers but whatever 
Spoilers. He has a skull that and that could possibly be a real unicorn skull. Gotcha. Could not be. And then he does a lot of history on it, and then it talks about he uses exposition with that to talk about unicorns. And the unicorns that he portrays are not necessarily the unicorns that. You would you would think of yeah, or at least may, maybe maybe they are, but it doesn't seem like it. Yeah, the way that I pictured them when he writes it, it's not. This yeah, way, yeah, same. that's cool. Yeah, so. kind of a different a different uh, visual you get. Yeah, it's cool. I yeah, that's a really good book though. Fuck, there's two in common. Oh, there's a hole underneath it apparently. Doesn't surprise me. Oh jeez, I'm just gonna rock and see what this does. Just beta. I'll hold back. Probably nothing. Hopefully not. Hopefully it does something. Uh, I like the over, over exclamation. The overuse, yeah. Yeah. Dude, this guardian hieroglyph. Well, I mean, it's supposed to be a, it's a mythical drawing, dude. Yeah, that's true. I don't know how you would hit, uh, like a an embodiment. Wow, what a smash! You just use a fucking uh, rubbing alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> Just throw it at him? Yeah. Hello? This casket seems a little suspicious. Well, I think I need to heal somebody. Let's see. Do you think A or B? B. I'm pretty sure it's B. What does he have? What is that called? Runny nose? Oh, it might be A. Yeah, with that, if it's sunstroke. It's a cold. B, but I'm stuck I here. think that would have been with A. But whatever. <laughs> okay. I actually think, do I need to go... Fuck. I shouldn't have- I shouldn't have left. I shouldn't have left this room. I want to go to the left and see if there's anything to the left before I keep going to the right. So I'm gonna bash my way through this guy. I do like, uh, how this game kind of explores imagery from all different kinds of cultures. We're supposed to be Jesus going over the world. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like it really makes it feel like you're exploring a bigger world because of how, like... Of how many of the the art, how much of the artwork in this game is indicative of like different places in the real world? You know, it's cool. Fuck, missed it. Dang, dude, I don't even know if this is right. But I went in. Yeah, I think this might be. I'll keep going up this. Going way. going backwards is right. Well, because I went, I came in from that doorway in the bottom left. And I, ooh, fuck yeah. And well, I think why this don't is. You just go all the way to make because, sure. Because I think this is a way. Because I think this is like an item up here. Oh, what did I just get? You realize the power of something. Something Omega? Let's take I a look know. at it. PSI magnet? Offense up? I think I got offense up Omega. That's pretty cool. Who's that? Oh, it's a mummy! Nice. Oh, uh, a guardian hieroglyph. So if you, uh... No, that's the thing behind it, isn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah, behind the shattered man yeah. thing. This won't hit him because it's not in the same row, yeah? I'll freeze it. I feel like fire is probably going to be the thing that's going to be super effective with it. Against the shattered man? Yeah. Let's give it a shot. We'll fire with Kagu, and then we can freeze with, um... Larry, since he doesn't have fire. 54. No, not at all. Larry sneezed. That's 245. So, so yeah, it's definitely it's a ice. Mommy. Why wouldn't fire? Well, it, it, I don't. Yeah, I have no idea. Dude, rocking. That looks so cool. Sh he's a shattered man, not a mummy. I don't know what that means, though. I'm not- I'm not sure what- what looked it, like a fucking mummy to me. What Shattered Man actually is, yeah, those wrappings definitely looked quite mummy-like to me as well. It looks like a duck and sounds like a duck. It's probably a duck, yeah? No, it's just a guy doing- <laughs> Just a guy doing a really, really good duck impression? Yeah, we'll go on. <laughs> let's see, let's I see could spend the whole on. episode trying to talk like Donald Duck. I don't even know how to do that voice. I've never been good at doing a Donald Duck. <laughs> Ooh. That's all I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do that. Hey, it's the fucking uh, thing right there. Yeah, what is that? It's the fucking thing. Oh, it's the thing. Yeah, yeah. that's yes. <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> like literally. Oh just no. Put on some fucking blue uh, blue speedo. And there's the invisible snake lady. See, there you go. It's half of the fantastic fucking four. 
The uh, <clears throat> all we need is the flame on Johnny Johnny Storm Johnny Storm <laughs> Human Torch the, the uh, Human Torch Mister Fan- Fantastic Yeah, Stretch Armstrong. Uh, did you no. ever have a stretch? Did you ever have a stretch Armstrong? Yeah, I think we've talked about Stretch Armstrong before. I, I think we have talked about Stretch Armstrong. Yeah, he was cool. Although I I liked the backpack better. Fuck, was that mortal? I don't know. Maybe I, I'm not really paying attention. Well, the backpack were a trio of people who were like the the enemy. Uh, there there was a big enemy of Stretch Armstrong. Can't remember his name, but the really? backpack. I don't really even know any of like the story, oh. or anything like that. The uh, yeah, he had a big enemy who was this red like guy who looked like this big red dude. I don't know. I don't know how to, else to explain it. And then he, there was the backpack, which was like three different guys who kind of looked like the bad guy. Okay. And then uh, they could be stretchy too. I don't know. I just had the ice one. I thought it was cool. God damn it! And they could put on armor. That's pretty badass. It's, I mean, it's all right. It's, did you ever? Did you ever watch Street Sharks? Yeah, I used to have the fucking puppets. I uh, Street Sharks are all right though. Apparently, they're making a movie. Yeah, but they said that like two years ago. I know. It could be in just production hell and never get out of it. You know. Yeah. It's just like Guns N' Roses was fucking Chinese democracy. They were talking about that record for like 10 years before it came out. Yeah. And it's one of those things where it's, oh, really working on it, really working on it. Nope. This guy's, uh, quite the peach. Dude, he sucks. Oh my god, I beat him. Okay, with one, I need to, I need to, I need to life up cheese. There you go, sudden guts pill. Perfect. Exactly what we needed. Um, I'm gonna life up cheese, I'm gonna check this, and then I think this is gonna be the end of the episode. So... Thank you guys... Is he dead? He died? When did he die? Uh, I didn't even uh, see him die! Uh, well, he's dead. Fuck! I, I think it did mortal damage. I, I don't but know. But he had one going out of it. God. Uh, well, we got a bag of Dragonite. Awesome. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Tune in next time. Hopefully we can figure out to do what, what to do with these, uh... With these ghosts. Yeah, those wrappings definitely looked quite mummy like to me as well. It looks like a duck and sounds like a duck. It's probably a duck, yeah? No, it's just a guy doing. Just a guy doing a really, really good duck impression. <laughs>